guys, it's Zanny. It's day 29 of Vlogtober, and instead of doing a video with my tiny sisters, tiny meaning 15 today, because they're watching Doctor Who, I'm doing it with the sister! They're watching Doctor Who without me? Yeah, they're watching it without us. We're going to film a video! But they said they were going to watch a different show. No, I would be down Doctor there Who. with them watching Doctor Who if I had known. You wouldn't film a video with me? Fuck that, no! Who? So I'm here with this sister. This is my sister Marie, and I know she's been in some videos on my channel. If you have been subscribed to me since I first put a video up on YouTube, she's in the Life Juice video. Oh. <laughs> which is still Hello. up on this channel. So if you want to watch 10 minutes of us talking like chipmunks, you could go check that out. So she's here visiting for a while, so we are going to film the siblings tag. Yes. Yep. <gasps> so the first question is, who is the oldest? That would be me. I am older by two and a half years. And taller. And poopier. <laughs> I'm poopier? Yes, you are a poop. Oh. <laughs> okay. So does that mean I have a little mm. smiling poop emoji on iPhones? Yes, everybody is a poop. Okay. You guys are poops. It, it's affectionate, I swear. Yes. Am I not supposed to antagonize the audience? <laughs> Please don't. I'm trying to gain subscribers, not lose them. So the next question is, what do you like and dislike about your siblings? Let's be nice on this question. Well, I like that she's tall and can grab stuff. Um, See, I'm not going to actually be nice and say things that I genuinely like about you. And I do genuinely like it. I'm taller by half of it an inch. It's enjoyable to not have to reach things. I'm half an inch taller than you. It makes a difference. What I like about you is that you're very artistic and you're very stubborn about things, which is also a dislike, but I like it when there's something that you feel very strongly about and then you just decide, nope, this is how it's going, this is how it happens because this is important to me. Can I do to the dislike part? Yes. Who has to be? Like, <laughs> she has to be the smartest person in the room. Uh, that's gotten better, but it's, it's still bad. <laughs> yeah. She has to be the smartest person in the room. And if I try to tell her a fun fact that she didn't already know, let me just pull up my phone and tell you 12 other facts that you didn't know. <laughs> so, I mean, I mentioned the stubborn thing. Um, but an another thing that's sort of a dislike. What I'm growing to love is that you just don't take any shit from people when it's it's a bit of a dislike just because someone will be trying to help you or show you something that like is the general this is how everything will be good and you're like no it's not what I want to do go away because <laughs> what do you and your sibling have in common we're we both have brown loud hair. and obnoxious and we both have dark hair well we have brown hair naturally that's yeah. really similar but yours I'm... is dyed yeah and we both wear glasses sometimes I'm not wearing mine right now we both wear jeans like 99% of our <laughs> lives. I think I was born in jeans. No, I liked dresses too much growing up and then I realized I can't do cartwheels and dresses. Yeah, so jeans. We both like driving. Yeah. And kicking butt and taking names. Yeah. And, and then something else we tend to have in common is that we're like ridiculously loyal to people that we've decided are our people. Yeah. And it's like if someone's messing with them or someone's doing something to them that we don't like, we, we get like mama lion. It's yeah. scary. <laughs> and also to the point of fiercely loyal is that like even when people do fuck up, we, we still tend... like them. Yeah, and even when we shouldn't, we're like, it's and like, then... it's, okay. it's okay. I still like you. And then like maybe something catastrophic happens. And then you're like, I should have not been friends with you a while ago. Funniest memory. We have so many, <laughs> though. Uh, uh, yeah. I can't think of Funniest one memory like, of the sibling? Let's yeah, that. The funniest memory, like, with each other. Well, I'm going to do funniest memory of you. Oh, God, I feel and like this isn't going to be funny to me. <laughs> it's going to be really funny. Oh, no. Well, since you know, okay, it wasn't funny at the time, but we have it on home video, so now it's hysterical. We were, like, dancing in the living room, and we had this big <laughs> wooden coffee table, and Marie ran into it, and she got really upset, and she goes, Mommy, the table hit me! And so our mom just told her to hit it back, and so she smacks it, and then she feels better, and yeah. she just keeps dancing. That's, that's one of my funniest, because... 
just watching it over and over again. Okay, um... This one was funny to me because I was younger, and I was like, wow. Ready? Like, how old are you? We're like 13. And... I have no <laughs> idea which one you're gonna say. <laughs> you're like 13, and you are too cool for school. Which is really like a big nerd. I'm a huge nerd. <laughs> a huge I nerd. just thought I wanted to be cool in our group of five kids. Yeah, and like she she would always like wear mini skirts and like tight oh, shirts. Oh yeah. And like what was funny was like she's thirteen and we went to the LA Zoo one time and she was walking with her group of like three friends. Like the other two they were all girls mm -hmm. and they were walking in a little row. I don't remember. And this I remember, at all. like, they were kind of trying to sway their hips, just a little bit, just I don't a little bit trying. This at all. And then these guys, like this group of guys, prowling like some lions, walked by them. And apparently, I didn't see it. They turned around and checked out their butts. Now the funny. <laughs> memorable argument uh when we were here in florida and we were taking karate at the time and we went up and down the hallways and up and down the stairs punching and kicking each other i don't remember it was this like, oh yeah i apparently have amnesia over everything that you're yeah. mentioning <laughs> um finally mom had to break us up and i was worried about giving you a black eye but like we were legitimately like trying to do the like kicks that were like the sideways kick yeah, like, like go the side kicks yeah and we were trying to like knock each other out you know you might have done that to me because i don't remember this at all well you got some punches in it too <laughs> my nose hurt <laughs> okay see since i don't remember that that's not what i would say our most memorable argument is the month long disagreement when I found out about you, your boyfriend, now husband. <laughs> Next one is, what do you and your sibling do for fun? We sit around with each other and play on our phones and we'll randomly turn it and be like, look at this. We're very teenage girly. Even though I'm 21 and you're 19. Yeah. You're still a teenage girl. I'm still I'm a not. teenager. <laughs> I haven't and been the with two the years. the internet says for a teenager... You're supposed to get like ten hour, nine or ten hours of sleep, so I'm still using that as a video <laughs> confirmation. But, um, oh, yeah, we just like to be in proximity with each other and yeah. play on our phones. Yeah, if we're just in the same space, we can just do whatever else, and we're good. We and also like going for drives, though, and we like going to amusement parks. Yes. And we like um, making really silly covers to. Broadway songs. I don't like that anymore. <laughs> I, I have like, so like many the, videos the of that on my computer. We do like to go to the salon together. So we like to hang out in close proximity on our phones, go for drives, and go to the salon. Describe each other in one word. Poop. <laughs> <laughs> Can you do something else, please? <laughs> that was the best, though. <laughs> I mean, I'll keep it, but can you do something else? <laughs> Like a legit describe me in one word. Bunny. I'm a bunny? Yes. You describe me as bunny. Yes. Why would you describe me as bunny? It just said one word, bunny. But why you would you bunny. describe me as I'm not a bunny. Do you always see me hopping around yes. and eating lettuce? Yes. I don't eat vegetables. You eat iceberg salads. I haven't eaten one in like three months. That's okay. You're a bunny. I would be a starved bunny. Yes. Okay. You're a carnivorous bunny. <laughs> I mean, I could be super obnoxious, just be like, oh, describe my sister in one word, vegan. Yeah. <laughs> that would make me seem pretentious. Yes, yes, it would. But you're fluffy and you're small ish. <laughs> and you're hoppy. Like, when you walk, you have this little hop. I, I do tend to skip. Yeah, right? I do have a tendency you're to skip. A bunny. Okay, fine. Bunny works. In which case. I would say kangaroo, but you're not that fat. If I were to actually describe you in one word, I would say charismatic. Thank you. 
Yes, you're welcome. I'm Bunny. She's charismatic. Mm -hmm. do, you, do you see this relationship? We're almost done. Okay, top ten Halloween costumes for women. Ten, sexy vampire. Nine, sexy witch. Eight, sexy sailor. Seven, sexy gypsy. Six, sexy nurse. Why do I have a feeling this is going to get worse? Five, sexy superhero. Four, sexy maid. Three, sexy pirate. Two, sexy cop. And the number one Halloween costume for women is dignified and respected business professional. Kidding, it's sexy kitty. Anyway, happy Halloween. <laughs> this is great. I know. This I is had to buy it. Fantastic. I love it. I had to buy it and then come and all the way to Florida just to show you. That's hysterical. Right? I had to buy it. I was like, oh, it's so progressive. Oh. Oh, wait. Okay. <laughs> okay, so the next one is, have you ever liked one of their friends? I think by like, they mean has a crush like, on. Like, 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 like. I don't know if you've ever had a crush on one of my friends, but we shared a friend that I had a crush on for like four years. Ryan. Oh, that's... <laughs> mm. uh, I don't think you usually hate my friends. Yeah, no. Favorite inside joke. We have so many and I can't think of any right now. There was one that was really good that every time we say it. We would just say it and bust out laughing, but I don't remember what it was. Oh. Right. What? Pancake. <laughs> just like... <laughs> Mauled by bears. And super shiny Volvo owner. <laughs> <laughs> to the restroom! <laughs> yes! 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 I'm so glad you thought of an actual one. <laughs> and Cosmo Kaching. Co I thought of Cosmo Kaching. It's not really an inside it's joke. It's not really though. an inside joke. It's, it's just, just pretentious just... teenagers being assholes. Yeah, I was trying to be cool when talking about Starbucks, basically. Yeah. Okay, and the last one is post slash show an earliest photo of you and your sibling. I have the picture of me and you as babies somewhere, so that'll go here. Okay, that's it. Right. That was our I sibling tag. She's being affectionate. And uh, yeah, that is it. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more videos with me and her, uh, let me know in the comments down below, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. All right, bye.